All right, for those uh, trying to get their uh, drive belt off of, uh, I got a 2001 Mercury 3.0 liter inline four, um, and I've been uh, looking at the iBoats forums, and everyone was kind of, there's a lot of questions on what size belt and all that other stuff. Uh, I noticed that uh, for most models, it's pretty much a standard 40 inch belt. And I seen a couple measurements on there of uh, 3 8 inch wide. Uh, I just went to AutoZone, picked something up. It's the only place I went to AutoZone, uh, checked Napa, checked the uh, auto parts or uh, advanced auto parts. And uh, AutoZone was the only one that had this one that was like about the same thickness. So uh, that part number is uh, 13 400. Uh, 400 being 40 inch belt, 13. I think it's just the uh, has something to do with the uh, the width of it. But uh, I've seen a lot of questions on what to remove for the spacer to uh, get this thing onto the pulley without, you know, having to do something funky with the uh, mounting brackets and stuff like that. And that spacer, what they're talking about is this guy right here, and uh, it just fits in there like so. And uh, what I did is I put a little uh, scissor jack underneath the engine and pumped it up a little bit just to keep it in place. And these bolts pop right back in there. Uh, real simple. It took me about 10 minutes to do that. And then... Uh, what I did was uh, shove something in there between the uh, motor and uh, the alternator to get that to stretch out the belt. It's nice and taut here. So as you can see, the uh, the belt from AutoZone fits in there real nice. It looks like it aligns real well. Uh, I've seen people saying that the uh, rust on the pulleys, I got a lot of rust on there. I might want to clean those up before I actually uh, take this out on the water and before I break another belt. But uh, not that hard. People are saying that they're buying extra pulleys to... Uh, get that in there but um, there was one space where it was actually you could see right there where my finger is that gets a little tight to stick the pulley in between the top of the engine mount and the pulley for the water pump um, I just kind of wedged the uh, the pulley through there I didn't have any issues with it I suspect if you have the right size uh, um, belt it's not going to make a difference uh, if you squeeze it in there I looked at and I looked at it real nice and it didn't mess with the belt at all but um, just to give one little more update what I did I took my breaker bar stuck it in between the alternator and the engine mount and I just pulled in there and it straightened out the uh, belt real nice and taut but that's all you need to do throw it all back together start it up if I have any issues I won't upload this video